Well, if you thought your Mac was safe from viruses, think again. A virus dubbed Backdoor Flashback infecting more than a half a million computers. It's disguised as a familiar program, but it can steal your username and password. I would issue reporter Kristen Thorne on the Upper West Side with details. Kristen? Well, Sade, if you talk to anyone going into the store here, what they love about their Mac, they'll tell you it's the fact that it doesn't get viruses. So for them, this is a rude awakening. Yeah, I, that's why you get a Mac. No problems. That's definitely one of the reasons. No viruses. But a virus is wreaking havoc on hundreds of thousands of Mac computers across the country. It's called flashback. I thought that Macs are safe, so that was just something that was kind of unbelievable. When they go after you by saying, hey, I've got this link or I've got this thing and it's something that you might want, so you click it. And when you click it, it brings you to a website. Thomas McCabe with Hero Techs on Long Island says the virus brings you to a website that allows hackers to use code to take over your computer and control it. And it gets even scarier. This thing can take your passwords as you type it in, encrypt it, and send it back to its, uh, you know, mothership, so to speak. So what can you do to protect your Mac? McCabe says the virus primarily resides in social networking and game sites. Don't ever click on a box or link that appears strange or out of the ordinary or something your friend wouldn't do or send to you. Someone puts a link on your wall, what do you do? If it's five people, it's probably legitimate that they clicked it. But if it's 180 people in like a five minute span, it's probably a bot that's going through somebody's address list. One of the best ways to prevent yourself from getting a virus is to always make sure to download the updates for your computer. Everybody that ignores it that comes in here with viruses tells me that they are afraid of pop-ups and they're afraid that if they click it, they're going to get a virus. Apple did issue an update for your computers a few days ago that should be able to prevent you from getting the virus. However, if you already have the virus, that update will do no good. We're live on the Upper West Side, Kristen Thorne, Channel 7 Eyewitness News.